They rocked it back and forth, then a crash. Got him. This six second video clip proof that the popular rock formation called the Duckbill, pictured in hundreds of posts, did not topple naturally as park rangers first suspected. They knock something so beautiful down that will like, you know, never be there ever again is just heartbreaking. David Callis took the video and tried talking to the group that pushed the rock over. They were all just being, you know, rowdy. They're just laughing about it, you know, like it was just a complete joke to them. But just getting to the seven foot tall formation was a hazard. Clear signs have been posted for years telling everyone to keep out, including people now posting tributes to the sandstone feature overlooking the waves. When you see a fence and you see a warning sign, respect it, stay on the right side. Online, the search is just beginning for the people in the video, and it's not the first time the internet has taken vandals of Mother Nature to task. Reddit users helped catch a woman whose acrylic drawings with the name Creepy Tings ended with her banishment from national parks. And this case of a very similar rock toppling in Utah that led to a year probation and thousands in fines for these former leaders of the Boy Scouts. Now on the picturesque coast of the Pacific Northwest, rock that once served as a pedestal for people, the latest to be brought down by man. Gotti Schwartz, NBC News. Hey NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.